Hey everybody, welcome back to DIY Boom Boxes in Texas. My name is Phil, your host, and I got a new project I'm about to start working on, and I wanted to show you this little device right here. This is a multifunction audio switcher that I'm going to be using on this project, and I'm going to explain why in just a minute here. Let me pull this out of the box. This is how it comes. And as you can see here, let me look on my camera so you can see what I'm looking at. Okay, right here you have um, several switches. Now this switch right here is the audio on and off. And you also have a volume control right here. And this is your A, B switch. And the way that works is you can have several sources coming in and out of this. So let's say you have the way we're going to do it here is we're going to have a Bluetooth board coming into side A and side B we're going to have an auxiliary input and they're going to be going out which is going to be right here to one amplifier. So the cool thing is you can plug two different things in here and switch back and forth by pressing this switch right here. And again the reason we're doing this is because we have one amp and we have two audio sources and as you can see right here they're regular uh, headphone style 8th inch jacks or I think it's 2.5 millimeter or 2.4 or something like that I don't know the metrics of it and they're gonna plug into right here so what we're gonna do is again this is gonna be a Bluetooth box which is what the gentleman wants so normally it's gonna be in the Bluetooth mode on A so A is gonna be pushed in but if he wants to switch over here to an auxiliary input that we're gonna put on the box Let's say for an MP3 player, you're going to plug your phone in directly or whatever you want to hook up, iPod. You'll be able to press that button and now it disconnects the Bluetooth board and now you're going to be connected to auxiliary audio. And again, I've never used one of these before. I'm not sure how the volume is going to work. I'm probably just going to leave it, at, I guess, set at maximum volume. Of course, Duke's over here wanting to get on the picture. But anyway, guys, I'm going to install this and then after I do, I'm going to do a video... Uh, review of the project and show you how it works which is going to be the next video so I just want to show you guys this little AB switch and I got a lot of the cool things come up also going to be doing an amp review pretty soon so stay tuned for that so let me know what you guys think in the comments below if you have any questions or if you want to build one of your own uh, please join us on my Facebook page at I Love All Things Radio and Audio as I love all things audio, radio and audio. Of course, here's Duke. So let me pull back the camera a little bit so we can say hello to Duke. Now let's go this way. Hi, Duke. Can't have a video without Mr. Duke. He's having a good day. It's Sunday afternoon. We're about to start this project. I just started painting yesterday, but I've never used this box before. I ordered it for another project originally. I've had this for probably about eight to nine months. Uh, what I originally ordered it for was I had a setup with a CD player and a um, Bluetooth, but instead I went ahead and went with a radio, and the radio's got the auxiliary switch built into it. So I didn't need this, but I was going to put this in there so you can plug in a CD player, a portable CD player, and also plug in your uh, Bluetooth port as well. Uh, these run about $20, I think. It's been a while since I ordered it, and I'll definitely put a link in the description below if you want to try one of these yourself. And my next video, I will definitely show you how it works so anyway Duke say hi to everybody Duke's in a good mood as usual I don't get this too often Duke's in a bad mood usually he's only a bad mood when uh, Linus starts to pick on him because Linus wants to play Linus is still a baby he's only nine months old and Duke is about almost nine years old so Duke's not in a kitten mood anymore and uh, of course Duke gets silly sometimes he likes to try to beat up on people too Duke can have an attitude when he wants it but he for most part he's a sweetheart so thank you all for watching and like I said next video I'll have this project up with this box inside and we'll do a complete review of how it works and everything because uh, the customer lives in Minnesota I believe and I'm in Texas so I want to do like an instructional video for them as well so thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you next time